Audi. This is my third video on the DIY circuit board sport welder kit assembly. The this is the unit assembled but it failed. I in the second video I said I would go through what I did and what came out of it. This is the border. the spot well the border this the probe lead the battery lead the other probe lead I ordered the capacitors but it came with a charging border and no bus bars I made the, the, that bus bar and I made this to hold up the spot welder border on the specs on the website they said to charge at 5.5 5 to 5.6 I didn't connect these leads yet when I connected this and start charging the capacitors that lead melted it melted. <clears throat> so I disconnected the whole thing I took out the boards and put the, the spot welder board on the capacitors by itself and I tried it again it didn't work so I decide if one is 2.8 volts together they are 5.6 volts when I put my multipurpose meter on the capacitors to check what voltage it has that one had uh, about one volt that one well I won't say this one or that one one had one volt the other one had zero volt so then I took my homemade power supply and I adjusted this to 2.8 volts and watch the amperage while it was going it had nothing on the amperage but the volts had 2.7 i monitored it for a while and all of a sudden i noticed smoke coming out from my power supply i disconnected everything right now that is dead I have to work on it. I disconnected everything and I put it on another homemade power supply I have. Still 2.8 volts and no amperage. I left it and I kept monitoring it. A little while I see the umbridge I cannot remember exactly what was the umbridge but it took and it started the umbridge started going down 
until it reached zero. That meant one capacitor was fully charged. I did the same thing to the other capacitor. It was charged. When I put this board on and I tried charging it through the board, that got very hot that I couldn't touch. And it has a red light. It came on. So I fiddled and experimented with it until right now the the that's a balance board you charge through it and it would cut off when it reached the right voltage it would cut off this does the same thing when i put that on it i welded these two leads but since I have it in parallel I connected a black hair and a red hair so it would charge both sides that didn't work so I had to do it individually and if I charge in from the board I would have to take out that bus bar and let the board do the charging but all that done when i ch put this on that's what it's doing this button here does nothing when i tried to do a a test weld i don't know if you can see this one of these things exploded i paid 23 dollars for the board right now that board is 25 on banggood and 260 shipping and handling i ordered that since in august the capacitors i ordered on eb i paid 3960 us for one when the per capacitors got to st lucia which is I paid 70 something dollars for both of them. When the capacitors go to St. Lucia, which I am in the Caribbean. Let me see. 79.30 for both of them. I had to pay a hundred and something dollars to clear it in customs. Now, the capacitors are okay, apart from the balance board, which gives a little problem. But a spot welder is not good. There is nothing you could do with a spot, that spot welder. And if you have to purchase a spot welder, better you get a spot welder with the battery <clears throat> that is 25 you would just say 28 dollars that is 79 i could have that money i could have get myself a good spot welder so this is the third video on this i'm making just to let you all know the outcome of this and uh, 
the capacitors. Right now I have to get something. This is not good anymore. But I would have to get something for these capacitors. Some form of using these capacitors. Which, that's new to me. And also, this is it. If you find this video was helpful and informative, please like, comment, subscribe. You're free to share the video. I'll put these things in the description. If you need a capacitor, well, you would know where to get it. I will still put this board in the description, but I'm not advising anyone to buy that. Although your luck might not be mine, my luck might not be yours. You want to take a chance, go ahead. It may work for you, it may not work for you. But what sense does it make throwing money? You know, this is it for now. Click on the bell icon so you'll be notified of my next video. Until the next one, see you. Goodbye.